place in the world from a trip to the Kruger National Park. Um, we are going to be doing a walking trip through the bush, staying at Nyari Rustic Bush Camp, just near Mapani Main Camp. Um, it's an unfenced camp, completely off grid. We're going to be staying there for three days and doing a couple of walks through the bush with uh, the Kruger Park Honorary Rangers. It's uh, bound to be a super, super trip.
Garrett. Hello. Garrett. Who can it? Thank you. And probably be having us back. Stop move. No, that's your name. Yeah. That's correct. Yeah. I can't need here uh, before the. <laughs> <laughs> so can you do that in Africa? <laughs> yeah. This is the, my first tight here. And smack it stuck in. Will it start with that? It's better. No. If I was sitting at the back. It's better. 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 It's better.
Been uh, dropped off in the bush, about to go off on our first hike of the weekend. We're going to be doing about seven kilometers heading out towards Mapani. No talking while we're walking, and no walking while we're talking. So, um, that means. Hey? No walking talking. Yeah, no walking talking. Okay, so if we see something special that we want to discuss, we will stop and talk about it. Once we start walking again, um, we keep quiet. All right. Walked about 5k's in the bush now, just stopped for a quick snack and a drink. Now we're heading back on, probably another 3 or so k's to the end of our walk this morning.
It's nice open air showers here at Inyari. Uh, you fill up some hot water, throw it into the shower bag, bit of cold water, and it makes it perfect for a nice refreshing shower out in the open. Jed's um, gone for an outdoor shower, so we're going to see if we can sneak up on him and uh, give him a bit of a fright. So this is a new product uh, that's come on the market. It is by Van Pfeiffer Outdoor. Um, it's a test unit that the guys have given me to have a look at. Um, and effectively it's an all-in-one uh, tent peg solution. Comes complete with bag, um, mallet to knock your tent pegs in, and a number of different uh, types of pegs that you can use for your camping needs. And if you open up the bag, there is a mallet and a couple of different um, shaped pegs. You've got your straight pegs, some of the L-shaped springy pegs, as well as a mallet that you can use to knock them all in. Um, everything's nice and neatly secured inside the bag with Velcro, so everything's got its spot. Um, it's a beautiful product, really well put together and something that um, I would certainly find very useful for my, for my own trips in the bush. I know that I often have tent pegs lying all over the place, so this is a nice and neat solution to keep them um, all together. I will pop a link in this video's description down below where you can um, find out more information on the Van Pfeiffer Outdoor Products range. It's just after sunrise on day three. Uh, we're about to do a 6k hike out to a place called Anyari Springs. It's a beautiful hot water springs. Last time we were there, we saw a good uh, eight or ten elephants wallowing around in the in the mud. So we're going to take a 6k walk out there this morning, and then sit at the springs for a little bit and watch the animals. Um, come back to camp, make a nice poiki for later, lamb neck poiki, and just enjoy the day relaxing around the camp.
you guess. Yes. Yes. Yeah. So one of the last, probably the last molar of a elephant. So this might have been the sixth set. And when they wear away, they they can't digest food properly anymore, and then they die off. That's the first time I'm meeting it. <laughs> Come on, pig. Come on. This is um, carrot. <laughs> yeah, this is tree. Tree. <laughs> tree. Impressive. Sick of more fish. I thought you realized how big this is. Hmm? I'm saying when you're up close, like it, you realize how big those buffalo are. Yeah. You would have known how big they are if they'd still yeah. be that up that hill. <laughs> hey, Doug, you see it? Straight into the grey bit in that tree. Mm -hmm. You see it? No. Yeah. 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 So this is a Nyari bush camp, a uh, rustic bush camp. It's um, run by the honorary game rangers um, of Sandparks. You can book it out um, for a three day um, stint and you get uh, access to three game rangers. Eight people is the number of people that can be accommodated. It is completely off uh, grid. So there's no running water, there's no electricity, so you have to have solar panels. You need to bring your own water for showers and cooking. Um, and then in the three days that you stay in the camp, the game rangers take you out on guided walks through the bush. Yesterday we came across a massive herd of buffalo. Um, we were sitting next to the river and this huge herd of buffalo came up the riverbed. Um, also quite hair raising, very up close and personal to these guys. This morning we came across um, elephant, 
literally 20 meters away from us they were crossing over the path um, out to Nyari Springs so it truly is an authentic um, bush experience unlike anything else that you're likely to experience at the Kruger Park. So the cost for a three-day weekend is about 30,000 rand split across the eight people. It's nothing quite like sleeping in an unfenced camp where there are hyenas coming into camp. We had elephants walking through the camp the other day. Um, it really is a magical experience and something that I would highly recommend. We're going to be doing a nice lamb neck poiki tonight for dinner. We are busy preparing everything. Party. So they'll put you the hard labor and make a good man of you. Ah, it's looking good. Exactly. Oh, Mustn't forget my German cans lying around. You're going to go shower. Yeah. Come here. Come here. Hold up. Oh. Naka, what's going on? <laughs> Sitting here in the hammock, having a great time in the bush, loving life at the moment. Salute. <laughs> so Gareth just sat on the chair and broke the thing completely. Broke through the metal. Through the metal. <clears throat> Cheap as I mean that. We want chair shot. Right, this is an X chair. It has ceased to be. And it's all because of Gigi! <laughs> Couldn't have
just like we had last year, we've got another flat battery, having to do some uh, maintenance before we hit the road, using the one car to charge the other one. Okay.